Good morning, Ardmore anchors, and welcome to WAES Morning News Show. Please stop and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stop and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Your Ardmore Anchor weather for today is cloudy with a high of 78 degrees and a 30% chance of isolated thunderstorms. Your PBIS thought of the day is, the most courageous decision that you can make each day is to be in a good mood. Voltaire, remember Ardmore Anchors, resilient Ardmore scholars are anchored in the three R's. Be ready, be respectful, and be responsible. It is time for the Ardmore Anchor word of the day. Apprehensive. Apprehensive is an adjective meaning anxious or fearful that something bad or unpleasant will happen. The sentence is, apprehensive about the consequences of texting and driving, Jill turned her phone off. Apprehensive, your Ardmore Anchor Word of the Day. Now for our Hispanic Heritage Moments. Gabriela Mistral. Gabriela Mistral was born on April 7, 1889, in Vicuna, Chile. At three years old, Gabriela's father abandoned her family, leaving Gabriela's mother to raise her despite health issues. Gabriela began teaching at the age of 15, out of financial necessity. She developed into such an effective and respected teacher that she was awarded the Teacher of the Nation Award from the government of Chile. Gabriella's deeply emotional poetry and her unique style of writing earned her many awards. In fact, at the age of 56, Gabriella Mistral was awarded the Nobel Prize in Literature. It is considered the highest literary honor in the world. Gabriella Mistral was the first writer from South America to win this award. Gabriella Mistral, our Hispanic Heritage Moment. Your announcements for today are as follows. Today is Tuesday, October 5th, 2021. MCAP and NWEA makeup testing continues this week. Important dates this month, September 15th through October 15th is Hispanic Heritage Month. October 11th, parent-teacher conferences and Native American Day, no school for students. October 15th, PD Day for teachers, no school for students. October 26th, students, your pumpkin book reports are due to Ms. Christo. October 29th, we will have our second annual Pumpkin Book Report Virtual Parade. So look for more information from Ms. Christo. Attention staff, when arriving each day, don't forget to complete Frontline. Bring your PPE and school photo ID. Teachers, please turn in your attendance in, turn it in daily at 10 a.m. and use the correct attendance codes. Parents, please make sure to notify all teachers and or office staff via email of your child's absence, as well as the reason for the absence. Students, please remember to clear your cosh each week, shut down your devices, and plug them up each day to allow them to rest, recharge, and receive weekly IT updates. Staff, please check your emails daily for FYIs, schedule changes, and updates from Mrs. Herring and other school leadership. Testing makeups continue, so students need to bring in their headphones with microphone. Please charge your Chromebooks and iPads nightly. All students should bring their fully charged digital devices to school each day as instruction will be provided in person and online. Masks are mandatory for all. Those are all of your announcements. Please raise your right hand and let's recite our school pledge. A one, two, a one, two, three. I pledge today to do my best in reading math and all the rest. I promise to obey the rules in my class and in the school. I respect myself and others too. I'll expect the best in all I do. I am here to learn all I can, to try my best to be all I am, to try my best to be all I am. Word. Text time for our news on WAES. WAES is signing off. Everyone have a great, great day.